Hello friends, welcome to our channel. Here is another video for you today and hope you will support me like always by sharing and watching till the end. Today, we will learn 100 civics questions by group. If this video is useful to you, please press a like and share it with everyone. Let's get started. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there are 50 states. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because of the state's population. Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. James Madison. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Franklin Roosevelt What did Susan B. Anthony do? Fought for women's rights. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? U.S. diplomat. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? Fought for civil rights. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Kamala Harris Who is the father of our country? George Washington What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Mike Johnson Who
Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Freed the slaves. What is the name of the President of the United States now? Joe Biden Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II Who was president during World War I? Woodrow Wilson Who was the first president? George Washington When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15 When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th In what month do we vote for president? November When was the Constitution written? 1787 What major event happened on September 11, 2001 in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? The Louisiana Territory. When must all men register for the Selective Service? At age 18. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? July 4, 1776 
Name one U.S. territory. Guam. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. Civil War. Name one state that borders Canada. New York. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Pacific Ocean. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War One. Name your U.S. representative. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic Ocean. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Missouri River. Who signs bills to become laws? The President. If both the President and the Vice President can no longer serve, who becomes President? The Speaker of the House. Who did the United States fight in World War II?
Japan, Germany, and Italy. Who makes federal laws? Congress. Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All people of the state. Who is the Commander-in-Chief of the Military? The President. Who is in charge of the Executive Branch? The President. Who vetoes bills? The President. If the President can no longer serve, who becomes President? The Vice President. Who is the governor of your state now? Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? The House of Representatives has how many voting members? Four hundred thirty-five. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. How many amendments does Constitution have? Twenty seven. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? Eighteen and older. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. How many U.S. Senators are there? One hundred. We elect a president for how many years? Five.
four. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil Rights Movement What are two cabinet-level positions? Attorney General Vice President What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. What does the Constitution do? Sets up the government. Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York Harbor. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? Serve on a jury. What did the Declaration of Independence do? Announced our independence from Great Britain. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star-Spangled Banner What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life, Liberty What is the political party of the President now? Democratic Party What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court What is the capital of your state? What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution?
the Bill of Rights. What is one reason colonists came to America? Freedom. What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. What does the President's Cabinet do? Advises the President. What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote. Join a political party. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Obey the laws of the United States. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Freed the slaves. What is an amendment? A 
A change to the Constitution. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Provide schooling and education. What are two rights of everyone? living in the United States. Freedom of religion. Freedom of speech. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizens 18 and older can vote. What is the economic system in the United States? Market economy. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and House of Representatives. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws.